This video is going to show you how to fix the problem of your HP printer cutting off the bottom part of any document you print. I say HP printer because as far as I can tell it only happens to this make of printer but feel free to try this if you're having issues with other printers too. So the main problem uh, with a printer cutting off the bottom of a page you're printing is that for official form it's cutting off the part of the form where you enter your signature and date. When you go to print something on your computer, the print settings box will open. I'm using a Mac Mini, but print settings will be similar on most computers. Here it will give you print options for things like paper size and scale to fit, but none of these settings printed the document to size without cutting off the bottom part. Uh, someone suggested converting a document into an image file using a program like Adobe Photoshop, which I don't have, and I didn't want to pay for it either. So, I did a Google search and found some websites that convert documents for free. Although the site I use is free, it does also offer a paid service if you need to do this frequently. I rarely need to print documents, so the free version suits my needs. The site I use is freepdfconvert.com. I'll also add a clickable link to the site in the description below. There are similar sites out there you can use, but as this is the only one I've personally used, this is the one I'm suggesting. But a Google search for a PDF to JPEG converter should give you more options. Now I'm going to save the PDF file that I want to print to my computer. As you can see, this site converts PDF to Word, to Excel, PowerPoint, PDF to Image, and even JPEG to PDF. We're going to do PDF to Image. So now we need to upload the PDF we just saved, which is DL43. And then very quickly, the document is converted into an image file and put into a zip file, which we just need to then download. My download folder then shows a copy of the downloaded DL43 folder, which I'll click on to open. Here we can see the JPEG image file. I'm going to click on that to open the document I want to print. Here we can see the whole document is now a JPEG image file. I'm now going to print the image file. The settings I'm using are US letter, scale to fit, print entire image, then print. Now when it prints, hopefully we should see the signature and date section on the bottom of the document. And there they are. If you found this tip helpful, please feel free to check out my other YouTube videos, tips, fixes and how-tos.